Hello guys, uh, this is June Area. I'm an artist producer and filmmaker based in Seoul, South Korea. I mainly film uh, Korean music videos and fashion. I have started filming some of my projects with the new Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K. I have already uploaded some footage for the ones that want to see how the camera performs in general. Personally, I'm really happy with this camera for my kind of work. I think it will be a really useful tool for any filmmakers out there at any level. It takes some time to get used to film uh, with this kind of gear. Uh, that's why I decided to do this series of videos that I'll be talking about my experiences with this camera and the best practices. So this is how I received the camera in its original box and sealed. This box is actually quite a bit different than the usual Blackmagic boxes as it is mainly white with images which is an interesting change. Nevertheless the box is what you would expect with selling points written all around. First thing there is in the box is this welcome card along with the camera software and manual. Right below there is DaVinci Resolve 15. Do mind that this is the full version that retails for $299. There are a few good features on the studio version that do not exist in the free version. Some people might need them, some not, but in either case it's good to have the full version. So, as usual with other Blackmagic products, they ship with these adapters in order to fit uh, to any kind of power outlet, no matter where in the world you are. It's also pretty neat because if you're moving countries or have a job abroad, you can simply switch the adapter and you are set. The camera comes with a single Canon LPE6 battery. These batteries are very common and can be easily found, including many third-party battery manufacturers. Finally, the camera is surprisingly light and easy to hold. Personally, I do like the design a lot and the monitor is very impressive. The most important is that the camera feels really robust. Every button, port and switch have a nice feel to them. Thank you guys for watching this unboxing video and uh, make sure to check the rest of the videos I made for this camera. In those videos I go in depth and give experiences and what I think they are the best practices for using this camera.